Hey, what's up guys? How you doing? Um, I know originally I said I was going to do a PC comparison, but uh, I'm still downloading the PC version. I don't know what's going on. Slow servers. So uh, whenever I'm done installing the PC version, I'm going to do that comparison. Uh, PC versus the PlayStation 4 Pro. But, you know... While we are still waiting for me to download the PC version and install it, uh, I figured why not me show you the PlayStation 4 Pro version and what I was able to do as far as the uh, TV settings, uh, picture settings that I customized on my own preference. And uh, what I have achieved here, as you can see, it looks fantastic. It looks like naturally as possibly as it can be and i like to use the word natural because that's what i was going here and uh i will show you my uh settings and what i was able to do in a minute on this uh samsung ks8000 here's a good example like right here uh with hdr as i mentioned it earlier on my videos Here's a one good example right here. Look at that lamp. Uh, it's not too bright and it's not too dark. It's just right amount of uh, light. And how do you achieve this? You know, a lot of you want to ask me, hey man, how do you achieve this? How do you get this? Well, first of all, remember, it's all about the balance. You, you got to be able to balance things out. You got to be able to balance the picture quality so it looks that way. As you will see on my uh, calibration. And when I talk about calibration, remember, this is my own calibration. You will see why that is. When you see my TV settings, you will say, wow, well, that's unusual. But there's a reason for that. Uh when I do a PC comparison, this is what what's going to happen. I just want to make this clear. Uh, first, I'm going to do a PlayStation 4 Pro versus X, uh, versus PC. Uh, you will see one minute footage of PC, and then I'm going to pause it, and then I'm going to switch back to the PlayStation 4 Pro and do the exact same footage for one minute. And then we're going to go back and forth and examine the... Uh, difference between the quality but you can see even in the dark areas here look at these mannequins uh, they look natural and, and that's exactly what you want in, in this type of game Oh, there's something here. Let's check it out. Ooh. Okay, let's fire one bullet. I want to show you something. Uh, look at the smoke detail on the gun when I fire the bullet. I'll just do one shot right here. Look, look at this. Let's do it here where the light is. Like right here. Hold on. Uh, I want you to look at this. Look at the barrel of a gun. Hold on, I gotta find a better lighting. Okay, let's say right here. Look at the barrel of the gun when I fire it. And look what happens. Just look at that smoke when it comes out. I don't know, did you guys see it? Hold on. I don't know, they, there, was, there used to be a smoke coming out of it, you know, when you fire a bullet. But not anymore, I was like... Okay, I don't know why, but there used to be. Alright, let's look at the map. It's the attic. There's a uh, there's stairs over here that takes me up. Let's go up. What the hell is that? 
Oh my goodness. There she is. Oh, Jesus, Mia. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Holy shit. Oh my God. That was creepy. Well, the thing is, I couldn't even, you know, I didn't even get a chance to, uh, be able to shoot at her but here let me show you my TV settings here really quick let me go to my uh, settings let me go to uh, expert settings right here all right this is what I'm using uh, backlit I left it at 15 because uh, I felt that even though it's HDR I felt that uh, too much contrast and too much backlit uh, it, it really oversaturates the picture it just makes it look too vibrant and I didn't like that brightness I left it at 42 contrast however I left it at 100 you see I'm talking about a balance here yes but this is not that bad backlit at 15 is just moved down a little bit not that much and then the brightness it's at 42 which is also not that much it's it's a it's a good uh, balance point uh, contrast it's at 100 because of the HDR I had to keep the contrast at 100 sharpness I left at 26 and color is 63 digital clean view I turned that off I don't need that uh, smart LEDs I turned them off all of these features I turned them off and of course I left the UHD color on and dynamic contrast off color tone I left it at standard and uh, color space at native and uh, it looks great well we're still in the attic right still in the attic so anyway hopefully you guys will try these settings uh, they look great like where's a good, good example right here look at that man that's how you should want your uh tv to look to look natural and you can achieve the same thing like i am i mean look at my finger right here dude look at that that's no tricks that's as uh, the, the deep black levels are as black as they can be uh, and that's what i was able to achieve here so go ahead try out these TV settings okay uh, I'm still downloading the PC version so as soon as my PC version is done I'm gonna go ahead and install it and then we'll do the comparison okay alright guys have a good one